I'm good, thank you. You know, I arrived this morning about 10 o'clock from London, and uh, yeah, I'm gonna enjoy tonight and then uh, back to London tomorrow morning. So <laughs> it's, just, it's a short visit, but you know, it's like a 13 hour flight, but it's cool. Uh, for you. <laughs> For my family, my wife's from, uh, from Cape Town originally, so I spent a lot of time coming um, coming to South Africa on family visits and stuff. And this is the second time I've actually DJed in, in, in South Africa, and the first time I've DJed in Joburg. But I love it. You know, I, I, if I could pick anywhere in the world to live, it would probably be you know Cape Town. That's how much uh, how much I really enjoy being down here. Um, but um, I have really good memories of being here. You know, even playing in the when I first played here back in like 2001 or 2003, I just remember the energy. It's so amazing. So I'm hoping to expect the same tonight. I got in. I used to play the drums in a band at school. Um, I was into like early day indie music, like uh, Happy Mondays. Uh, Stone Roses, Oasis, Blur, bands like that, and I play, and then uh, I sort of got into electronic music by listening to people like Chemical Brothers, Daft Punk, you know, that sort of underworld, middle ground between DJs and, and, and bands. Um, I then bought some turntables when I was 15, uh, and then worked in an insurance company, um, and I got made redundant. And, uh, it was brilliant because it meant that I could go and work in a record shop for, and earn no money but love the job that I was doing. So I was working in this local record store in my hometown, just playing at uh, local bars and then I got a residency um, at a club called Club Class in Maidstone which is my hometown. And uh, they used to have DJs like Pete Tom, Carl Cox, uh, Sasha, everyone played there and I used to do the warm up sets. And, yeah, that's how I got in. I got in from like the ground. I did the, the ghetto way, you know, from the from the record shop to the, to the studio to the, to the club. So. Funky, groovy, and happy. That's cool. Yeah. Um, like I was saying earlier, I think uh, the experience of that sensation is totally different than any other gig that I do. It's uh, it's like uh, Cirque du Soleil meets dance music. It's like a it's a, it's, a, it's a show. So it's not just about the music. It's about the production. It's about you know the sensation. It's the whole it's the whole thing. And um, it's a, it's a it, you know if you haven't done it, it's an incredible experience. It's, it's nerve wracking to play because you know you've got so many people around you, um, but it's a lot. Of fun. My favourite colour is black because obviously it's house and techno colour. <laughs> so wearing white. Okay. You have to be pretty confident to wear white. <laughs> and I don't well, think you I, don't have to tell Yeah, us. and I, it's not my favourite colour. But um, yeah, you have to wear it. So yeah, I'm not a fan. <laughs> I have no interest in it. Absolutely no interest. I, it means nothing to me. How can you how can you vote? Music when everyone's got their own different music. It's just it just doesn't seem make sense because I looked at I looked at the magazine last year and none of the people or the peers, my friends, that were in there. So it, it, it means nothing to me. But it, it obviously serves a purpose to some people. So I'm not knocking it. I'm just saying that to me personally, it means absolutely nothing. Okay, we tend to agree with that. It's yeah. more like a popularity contest than a. But it's not. You know, you can't judge people on their talent like by voting yeah. for them. If they, you know, you, the charts making music. That's understandable because people buy physically buy your music. But um, to, to decide by sending an email who your favourite DJ is. Just Good, good. Steps a lot, steps all day. <laughs> and um, yeah, it'd be good. I like playing there, uh, because obviously this place is packed by sensation. It normally starts about 7 or 8 and it's packed by 8 o'clock and I'm playing 8.30 till 9.50 50 or something. And it's so much fun, because you're playing to a full crowd and it's really early. So you're, that is it's cool. Not, it's not like 6 in the morning or something like that. <laughs> like it's the graveyard yeah, shift, yeah, yeah. we're starting our warm-up yeah, yeah, yeah. Hi, I'm Nick Van Chuli and I'm here at Sensation White in Johannesburg in South Africa and I'm looking forward to playing for you all tonight. <laughs>